I was just browsing Twitter, looking at random people's pages, you know, people that I'm friends with and whatnot, and I happened to come across John Carlo Paramango 11's page, and I was there just to see what his thoughts were on the whole new Pokemon starter thing and whatnot. Just, you know, basic stuff. So I'm on his Twitter, and I see him talking a little bit about the Pokemon stuff. He's mentioning how um, TGN and um, Game Explain are doing the same thing he is. I think he's getting attacked once again. But you know John Carlo, man, he's always getting attacked by niggas. This is a standard thing at this point. It's part of the lifestyle. But I look further down on his page, and this is something that I didn't catch because I was out doing laundry. Once again, we ran out of towels, and I see this being posted on his Twitter. Friday the 13th, and nothing bad has happened to me today. But my friend, you just retweeted something from Nintendo of America. Do you see this tweet right now? Favorite for Slippy and retweet for that boy. This isn't the first time that we've seen meme culture spewed from Nintendo. It's happened on multiple fronts, sometimes in game references, a lot of times on Twitter. But this is, I feel like this is the first time where it's just so blatantly shameless. Like, they have no remorse. They just straight up post that boy. It's, first off, I gotta explain to you all that it took me two weeks to understand this meme, if you can even call it that. And I still don't understand it, to be real with you. I mean, but I feel like I at least get where the, the comedy is coming from. I retweeted a picture of it as well. But Nintendo doing it? Come on, dog. Y'all ain't showing us nothing for E3. Y'all ain't got no NX information going up. But y'all giving us that boy? <laughs> that boy? <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. Nintendo. <laughs> Nintendo. Woohoo. <laughs> Oh my god, bro. I, I'm, I'm just so surprised by this. This came out of nowhere, man. It did, And look at the day, bro. It, it, you're damn right it's Friday the 13th. This is a horrible day already. Look at the weather, man. It's already raining outside. It's a shitty day for the most part. Look at this shit. I gotta do laundry in rain. I gotta fucking... Look at this shit, man. This is crazy. I gotta do the laundry in this shit. It's, it's been killing me all day, man. And then on top of it all, Nintendo decided... <laughs> But being real with you all, I mean, I know I'm poking a lot of fun at it, but I think it's still hilarious. As I said, I love meme culture because I've been a part of it since the shit fucking was created. But seeing Nintendo jump on the bandwagon is just hilarious. It warms my heart. But goddamn, let's see some of the comments and responses to this. Because if there's one thing that's funnier than memes, it's the response to them. <laughs> Liam Robinson with that stop sign from Elmo right there. This, this gif lasts like a good 30 seconds, man, or almost. It feels like 30 seconds. That stop sign just constantly comes to you. It never stops. And we have another funny-ass picture here. You have to choose between Slippy and that boy. If you don't understand what the reference is for that boy, I'm not the person to explain it to you. Just please look it up. It has a background, but I still don't get why it's funny. But I, I, whenever I look at one of the memes that are well done, yeah, it's, it's kind of funny. And then we have another picture. I don't even know where this is from, but A-Star the third posted this shit. And then we have um, Digitized Nate saying, you did know. <laughs> he couldn't even finish the sentence. Nigga said, you did know. And then, what a time to be alive. I know, man. It's crazy. Um, this guy, Joe Stabber, saying, that boy in the striped jeans. So, you know, it's just going to basically be regurgitation of the same meme in different forms. But sometimes you get a witty comment, like Victory, Victory um, Condescence saying, stop, he's already dead. And yeah, I think the I think that that boy thing has been like out the window for a while now. But these companies usually never jump on board until they know that something was amazingly popular beforehand. So they kind of take advantage of it after it's already been overutilized. And so I, that's why it's like, Nintendo, come on. Maybe two weeks ago, this would have like, come, come on, <laughs> that boy right now. And I just thought this is a funny little thing to talk about. Fire Emblem episodes will be going on later today, as well as um, some Smash Brothers stuff coming later as well. I'll talk to you guys. Peace. Wait, hold on. There was actually one more post here. Had my boy Rogers Base talking about, no, you didn't. Nah, they did, bro. They did. And we have uh, HMK talking about, my God. This is fucking crazy. When your boss sees the retweet number, <laughs> I gotta save this picture. This shit's going right in the fucking save folder because that that's hilarious. Kimishima's like, what? The, the memes, the memes are popular. Oh, more. Add more. <laughs> so when we get the NX, like, I, I bet it's just gonna be called the meme X at this point, man. But anyways, I'll talk to you guys later on. What are your thoughts on Nintendo on Friday the 13th tweeting out something in reference to that boy? I guess maybe this is some way to try to get some more attention on Star Fox Zero since it hasn't sold that well. Okay, that's shots taken. I'm going to leave right now. I'm so sorry.